Is working for the city of West Palm Beach considered a good job? Are there good working conditions? Are people satisfied? Well, it turns out we don't even have to ask those questions. Mayor Jerry Moyo paid a company $40,000 to survey all 1,600 city employees, and only News Channel 5's Amy Lippman has the results. Amy joins us now live with more on her investigation. Amy. Well, 1,000 city workers offered their thoughts on dozens of statements about what it's like to work for the city of West Palm Beach. This graph here shows the results. The employees at the library at the top here, for example, they like their jobs. Firefighters are in the middle here and they're mostly satisfied. But when we get to the bottom of this graph here, that's where we find West Palm's police officers. True thoughts from city employees. One of my sayings is that even on our best day, we can be better. That's why the city of West Palm Beach paid the company a great place to work, 40,000 taxpayer dollars to put together a survey and collect the results. Their whole model, great place to work model, is based on trust. Um, how do you trust your colleagues and uh, do you trust the people you work for? The survey is based on five concepts, camaraderie, credibility, fairness, pride, and respect. Here you can see the police department scored the lowest in all of those categories. We had difficulty getting the, all the police cars that the police needed and they needed their cars and they weren't getting them in a timely fashion and they were upset about it and I don't blame them for being upset about that. They should have gotten their cars. The highest scoring departments for those core concepts included the library, parking, the mayor's office and support services. I think those departments that are in this building um, because it's much better communication in this building, tend to score higher. Employees across the board appreciate their time off, training opportunities, and the effect they have on the community. That's their job. They get to, to serve people. And they're very proud of that. But maybe the most revealing takeaway, most city workers feel they have no say or input on decisions that affect their own jobs. That makes a lot of sense to me. So we're trying to figure out how to make sure that that happens. Since getting the results, the mayor has been meeting with small groups of employees to go over the survey results and get even more feedback. She says the city will then put together an action plan to address the issues employees brought up. We have more detailed results posted on the Scene on 5 section of our website, WPTV.com. I'm Amy Lippman, WPTV News.